G'day guys, what is going on? We are back out here in the garage with Next Generation Motorsports. James, the brother. Back, man. Always good to see this man. And um, your car. It's got no engine. Yeah, it's missing something. I think it's over here, but uh, <laughs> dude, if you haven't seen the video, I'll leave a link for it down below. Absolutely hectic. We did a video with you, man. It was so much fun. Manual B series, like over a thousand wheel. Yeah. Just. It was fun. Party, party stuff. Good to see you back on the man. <laughs> I always like to come back here, man. And um, bro, I see that you you're doing good, man. I see Vera's yeah. being built. Another hectic one behind you, and um, the one we're going to be featuring. Yeah, yeah. We'll talk about Damien Rhodes in a minute. Yeah. Um, Last time we were up, we didn't really get to see the chances of what we were doing, and we started from pretty humble beginnings. Goddamn. Gold Coast. Yeah. <laughs> um, and this is the little workshop we've set up, which we are rapidly expanding and yep. are about to actually move into a big compound property and go full throttle. We've outgrown this. It can't keep going this way, so... Mad. That is our engine that we're currently building for the next-gen car next time. And we've got it set up, ready to grout fill it, uh, get it sent off to be machined, and... Yeah, I'll uh, measure, balance, rotating assembly and start start putting it together and yeah, watch this space, I guess. <laughs> yeah, Kim, hey, when it's done, I'll be coming back. I want to yeah. see this thing, bro. <laughs> yeah, another cool one. We actually just put this engine in this morning. This is Sam Baker's G6E that we're building for him. Yeah. So 1250 wheel, built ZF Monster Torque box. Wow. Big turbo setup, side design fabrication again, coming to the party with another one of his ProMod manifolds, exhaust cooler piping and stuff. So another cool project on the go. So yeah, things have escalated since you saw me last. That's yeah, for sure. Good. It's good, man. Yeah, yeah, like you obviously got the uh, you got the goods, man, and people are coming and waking up. So yeah, um, another one we've been working on that's just had a 750 horsepower run-in tune put in it is uh, Justin's XT Sleeper Falcon, which is not so sleeper because it does have side pipe uh she's noisy <laughs> it's plumb, plumb the gate back they said and then side pipe it but uh yeah this thing is going to go pretty big horsepower too we're hoping for around the 1300 horsepower mark wow pretty similar to what damien's fg which is actually the the car that you're going to review today yeah yeah so it was yeah. just cool to we're just we're come just gonna through experience and that thing bro, see where it all happens <laughs> and stuff and, <laughs> and yeah damien was uh really cool about bringing his ute over and yeah another project that we did um about six months ago yeah, uh, 1300 horsepower wheel FG manual ute. Yeah, let's go have a look at this thing, bro. <laughs> yeah, man. It's go. absolutely off its head, guys. Damien, hey, yeah. thanks, brother, for coming down. And, hey, dude, yeah. this thing's it's, it's pretty, pretty cool. special. Yeah. Different. Manual 1300 horsepower at the wheels. Yeah, the, and the original owner came to me to build the car. He purchased a crate engine from down in Victoria. Uh, unknown engine builder was. A bit of a concern for us so we decided to pull it down uh, it did have some good gear in it so it's a measured and balanced spool bottom end that's uh good for over 14 1500 horsepower so yeah stage five cams um some good atomic gear in there for the timing setup and everything and mechanical fuel pump setup that we did on it so she's definitely not shy of fuel it definitely it gets up so it made 1295 on like 32 pound of boost at profile so it's, yeah. Yeah. TR 6060. Oh, yeah. They built or no? Or it just... It's a turbo box. <laughs> yeah. We only just found the limit of the box in ours, so I've got another box there for that. We are still keeping it manual, but we broke that the other night. 11, 1100 horsepower with nitrous on the street. We did an input shaft, but we were being pretty nasty to it. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dude. Yeah. yeah. This thing's this thing's off its head. And a Ute trail. too. Ute manual. Thirteen hundred horsepower. Like it's just. Pretty cool. That's um yeah the next next generation isn't it? Hey, that's a... on, man. <laughs> We're trying. God damn, that is a turbo. Yeah, G47. Bro. <laughs> yeah. It's a big dog this one. Uh, oh it hasn't even my. really been pushed the boundaries. Like it, we could see 40 pound of boost through this thing, and it might make 1500 horsepower. So we'll just have to see what it does. Speak to the tuner and then run it up again. But um this is the tune that's in it now for 13 wheel and um. He said that's nice and safe at the moment, which is insane to say that it's nice and safe, but yeah, it's got some really good gear in it. And um, Damo's recently acquired it and um, he's just in the process of getting some more tidy up work done on it with some wiring. Uh, we did some anti-lag set up on it the other day, so we're testing that. He's just got some PSR radials on it. Um, so yeah, kind of the first real hit with you in the car is going to be him giving it a crack with some radials on it. So. <laughs> 
Pray for me, guys, bro. Yeah. <laughs> God damn. Dude. But, uh, yeah, man, I'm keen to hear this thing fire up and uh, let him take you for a spin. Yeah, I'm keen, I'm man. It's pretty, pretty I'm, wild. I'm going to drive my <laughs> daily territory and hang back, and you guys can go nuts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, this would be cool, man. It'd be quite an experience, man. So thanks let's for coming. Let's go. Ah, you, always, bro. Always good to see you. Love it, man. <laughs> hectic barrel I've been in, like legitimately. This thing is the most powerful barrel we've shown off. Yeah. 1300 always found the wheels is just stupid. Yeah, that's nice. We've, um, you know, we've been in a couple that were 12, but I can already tell this thing's on a different level. It's um, one of the biggest turbos I've ever seen in my life, I think, Jesus. <laughs> and the fact we're manual, bro. Fucking hell, bro. What is that? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, and I looked at the dyno sheet, and yeah, I think you don't even start building boost until like five and a half thousand RPM or yeah. something. gotta be committed in this thing and bro it's yeah that's a lot to commit to <laughs> Dude, 
ridiculous. It just when it's on, yeah, it just looks like it's it just you can't even like nothing else even. You can't focus on anything. Like nah. it's just that that noise goes right through you too. head man like absolutely terrifying usually guys as you know i usually get in these cars but this one it's i don't even want to like <laughs> i don't want to because it takes a special person to drive that thing manual you yeah. that's, that's full that game bro is. that is full game yes, it is. <laughs> but fun. man thank you so much for coming on the channel um obviously guys we're sponsored by c-tech as always link for them is down below so we're gonna give you a trickle battery charger awesome. bro because appreciate it it's not a daily I think <laughs> so. <laughs> nah, you got a daily 1300 day horsepower. Yeah. You. Nah, you got to go. Yeah. There's no point hiding it. Yeah, place, yeah. Man. We don't hide it, so that's the cool thing, man. And um, you ain't afraid to drive it too. Nah. So that was that was cool. I hope you guys enjoyed that. We're alive. We're in one piece. So yeah, we made it. And uh, guys, again, if you enjoyed this video, subscribe. Hit the like button. We'll see you on the next one. <laughs>